Just a little bit. Now. Hey y'all, welcome to Dish This, the show where the tea is hot and the treats are, well, I'll be the judge of that. This is a challenge where two contestants go head to head to create a recipe using only a photo as reference. Hey guys, I'm Danny. Hi, I'm Devin, and we're the Perkins sisters. Hey girls, how's it going? Good, how are, how are you? you? Hang it in there, I'm excited to uh, torture you just a little bit. I'm excited. That sounds really fun. So today, you two will be making... <gasps> pancakes? We're making pancakes. I got this. Yeah. Definitely, I'm gonna win. I'm literally the better cook, but... The twist is that there will be a blueberry syrup on top. I love blueberries. I, okay, she doesn't like, like blueberries, but you have to make syrup. Okay. Oh, you're confident. Yeah, what? I feel like I just put my, a little Devon taste on top of like whatever I make, and it just makes it 10 times better. A Devon taste? Yeah. What is that? A little splat. Okay, so you've got all of the ingredients that you need in your pantry and your fridge. Now, may the best chef win. Okay, but, but, whoa, is it tight? No, but I wanna win. Awesomeness is giving you all the ingredients, but you won't know the measurements. And you only have one picture to work off of. It's curdled buttermilk. I've never used that for a pancake, ever. Think of tools, think of things you're gonna need to mix things in. Got a bowl. A, a cup, like, oh no, I know what I need to do. Whoa. Measuring cup, measuring cup. How are we both gonna, I'm so confused. How much should I use? I can't tell you. See, that's why this is coming in handy for me because I actually kind of memorized how to make pancakes from scratch. I'm going to interject really quickly and maybe give y'all some tips on baking soda. So I'm going to give you a range of numbers and you have to decide how much of each you think you should use. I know. <laughs> okay. Remember, this is going to affect potentially how they cook and the taste, obviously. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can either use half a teaspoon, one teaspoon, or one and a half teaspoons of baking soda. One and a half teaspoon. A little goes a long way, or maybe you need more than you think. What's happening? So maybe you can even read your boxes, uh, or the actual baking powder, or the baking soda, and get an idea of what it's supposed to do for your food. I got it, I got it. You literally just checked the box. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. I didn't do any such You're thing. You're literally reading right I didn't now. do anything. You're just accusing me of things. Uh, wait, is this teaspoon or did you use a bigger one than me? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. If you're asking if that's a teaspoon, then divinity, I'm already a little worried for you. <laughs> I don't, just let me, give me. So, so far I've put my flour in my bowl and now I'm handling my butter. I'm gonna put it in the microwave, so. I'm confused. I'm ripping up butter right now. I don't even know what's happening. I don't understand syrup. I like syrup. I don't know how to make it. <gasps> I feel like I'm in Hell's Kitchen right now and I feel like I'm about to get yelled at. I just don't know what <laughs> Maybe I need to start yelling at you. Will that give you a little bit more motivation? That would really help. Devin, do this now. <laughs> okay. <gasps> oh my God, I just spilled it. I'm my bad. <gasps> oh, it's in your shirt. It's in my shirt. I. Just I can't do this, it's giving me excitement. So while you two are cooking, we are going to play a little game. And by little, I mean substantial because it's going to significantly affect your cooking outcome, potentially. I call this tooling around. You may have noticed you only have one spatula in front of you, and unfortunately, only one of you is going to be able to use it. Okay, I'm so scared, I'm not good at it. So keep cooking. <laughs> I believe in you both. Okay, first question. Name all of Kim Kardashian West's children. Got it. Chicago, North, um, Saint. Culture. That's, that's Cardi B. Oh, I don't know anyone. Wait, it whatever. starts with a P, but the P is silent. Uh. <laughs> I don't know. Daniela, I'm gonna give that one to you because you got three out of the four. It is actually Psalm. Oh my gosh, I remember seeing that. Okay, keep cooking, keep cooking. Guys, right, so I'm gonna put a little splat of baking soda, just a little bit, a little, a little bit. Okay, better. next question. What was the name of Ariana Grande's character on Nickelodeon? Sam and Cat. Cat. Cat Valentine. Perfect, there you go. Next question, Divinity, you've gotta pull this out of your hat here. I really hope I do. How old is James Charles? 20 
Okay, congratulations, Daniela. You get the spatula. spatula. Divinity, you're gonna have to start thinking now of what you're gonna use in place of that. What's gonna flip your pancake and make sure it is nice and round, nice and even, cause it's not gonna be a spatula. Guys, I actually think I'm doing pretty good. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, I really think this is gonna be good. I just need a pap. Did you guys pull eggs out of the fridge? Yeah, I put two eggs in. I don't think I was supposed to do that. Don't look at me like that. This is my reaction. He smiled at me, so maybe I'm doing good. I don't like yours. They look identical. No, they don't. Mine's better. Oh my god, yours looks so gross. There's lumps in it. What? Yeah, Guys, Devin literally, stick. no, they need to see this. Do you see that? She put just sticks of butter Yo, in her batter. It'll go away soon. Devin, you are disgusting. It'll go away. Okay, anyways, let me, I'm heating up my butter in there. Like a pro. This looks bad, actually. I need to do something to fix this. I think I'm gonna add more flour because this is just, I'm gonna add some honey, just a little bit. So as you two are beginning to cook your pancakes, it is now time for truth or tip. Whoever gets the most personal and opens up most will either get a cooking tip from me that'll help you with your dish, or you'll get to sabotage your sister and remove a key ingredient from the recipe. Whoa. Ready? Question number one. Who was the last person you kissed? Oh, my boyfriend. Uh, for me, I would say someone I'm talking to at the moment. Who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? The people want to know. He's a New Yorker. That's all I'm going to say. You do get points because he's from New York and I'm a New Yorker, so I'll, I'll give you points for that. Okay, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's a crepe. I made a crepe? Probably not. Oh my gosh. No, no, it's not going to work out. It's just not going to work out. <laughs> it's just not. It's not gonna work out. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god, she set the eggs on fire! Oh, oh. Okay. Update. You set the eggs on fire. You set the eggs on fire. Just a little bit. I was like, what is Just that a little smell? bit. Ah! I just brought myself. Oh my god. Devin, no, I can help you. I don't want your help. Oh, here! <gasps> Look what I found, guys. Good solve with the tongs. <laughs> Okay, she's going for oh. a flip. Oh. Wait, my pancake looks good. <laughs> okay. Question number two. So out of all of your fellow co-stars, who is the biggest diva on set? I really enjoy being on set with my crew and my cast because we're all really humble. That's me being very honest. They say if you can't name the biggest diva on set, that's usually you. <laughs> I don't see it. Me? Really? Yeah. <laughs> okay, last question. I want you each to tell me your worst habit. When I get nervous, I stutter a lot. Like a lot if I get like, and that's a really bad habit. I don't know why it's a habit. It just like happens. Like when I don't know what to say, I'm like, I, 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 and they're like, what? And I'm like, yo, like I can't. Before I take a bite of any food, I have to smell it. That is, mm, yeah. Okay, so I'm now going to announce who won truth or tip. And that person is Devin. So you get to actually decide, do you want a cooking tip from me to help you with your pancakes? Or do you want to have an ingredient taken away from your sister? I'll have a cooking tip. Oh my God, you're trying. Yeah. I'm gonna let Devin get her cooking tip. I'll be back. Devin, before I give you the tip, I'm curious, did you try one of your pancakes yet? Actually, I can have a bite of this. Something's wrong. Oh my god. <laughs> Tell me what's wrong, because maybe I'm going to tailor my tip. It just doesn't taste like a pancake. I would definitely say the baking soda. I put a little too much in there. Is your batter thin? It's thin. OK. You're gonna thicken it up by adding a little bit more flour and then a little bit more sugar. There we go. Guys, look, now it's thick. I actually think it's gonna be good, guys. I hope. Okay, now let's get a head start on our sauce. So obviously blueberries. Okay, so I know the recipe calls for lemon juice, but I'm gonna go in my backyard and pick a lemon for my tree so it's like all fresh because I feel a fresh ingredient is better. Oh, she's bougie. Ow. Oh God. I did it. I got him. Where's more charge? It's to thicken up our syrup. Got it. 
It should really only take you like five minutes to make a syrup. I am hammering blueberries, so they're crunched up. I'm trying to cook frozen blueberries, and it's kind of hard. So I decided I'm gonna like melt them a little bit in a uh, saucepan. I like the direction this is going. Like, what do I do? Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. How's it looking? Is it looking syrupy? It looks like just blueberries and I don't know what to do. Like, what? What? what, Danny? What? what? Nothing, nothing, nothing. She still hasn't added the cornstarch. Should, should I make it a little? Oh, what was that thing I'm supposed to put in that makes it like that? Oh, dang it! Keep it simmering. Okay, wait, guys, what the heck did I just make? I don't know, but pancakes are looking a fire. I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm actually so excited. Mine's actually turning into syrup. I don't mean to be evil, but I'm going to be because it's fun. This is a surprise round where you have to now add something to your sauce to kick it up a notch. It could be anything in your pantry or fridge. You need to go find that and add it. Daniela, what are you adding to your syrup to give it a little extra kick? I added vanilla. Okay. Okay, you know what? Guys, what the heck this is it working? You, you know what? what? You're about to add chocolate. God, that's such a good idea. I love you. Chocolate is fine. Okay, you only have two minutes, and then I need them all on the plates with your syrup. <laughs> Keep the photo in mind. Remember that presentation is everything. Uh, I don't know where to put it. It's like super hot. I'm loving this out loud thinking. But where did my blueberries go? Okay, I'm only gonna give you one more minute. Oh my god! Look at that! Um, okay, okay. So now I'm gonna drain this. It's actual syrup. I made it out Okay, you syrup. have 10 seconds to plate your dish. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Hands up. Step away from your dishes. Danny, hands up! I had to hand up! I will be judging based on presentation, accuracy, and taste. First, let's delve into presentation. And both of these, I would say, look pretty close to the photo. Divinity, yours has turned somewhat green. <laughs> yeah. It was a result of adding chocolate to your sauce. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to give Daniela this one on presentation because it really looks just like the photo, kind of like creepily so. So next up we have accuracy, and I would say your steps and your process were pretty accurate. You made your batter, you put them on the skillet, the actual making of the syrup was so spot on. So last but not least, unfortunately, I can't be there myself to taste it, even though I really want to. So first I want y'all to taste your own, give me your honest feedback, and then I want you to do a plate swap and tell me honestly, again, whose tastes better. Okay, I'm going for it. I just, I'm gonna think it tastes bad no matter what. Me too, I'm scared to put this in my mouth. Taste it all, oh my you gotta God. do one big bite. I mean, like, uh-uh, uh-uh. Something's just, I, I can eat it, I'm gonna choose not Sorry, to eat just, like, it. Went out. Uh, something just like, is just really off about this. Divinity, so, did you spit yours out? <laughs> All right, make the swap happen. Oh, oh, I'm really scared to try yours. Oh, jeez. Okay, here we go. Yours isn't bad, and your sauce tastes good. Something's wrong. Are you sure know. that was chocolate you know. put in your syrup? It was really bad. <laughs> I don't know, it was really bad. But it looks pretty. Okay, I am ready to announce the winner. And the winner is... Daniela. <laughs> yeah. Yeah! I want to thank our special guest for participating in this episode. If you liked what you saw, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to Awesome Miss TV, Chow Hound, and our contestants. Yay! Thank you guys! Thank you guys so much! Bye! Bye! Bye.